Hey everybody, it's Jake Moran with Keller Williams, and today I'm going to save you a ton of headache. I'm going to save you a ton of headache, I'm going to blow your mind, and I might make you feel a little bit better about the condition of your garage, because I'm coming to you from mine. The biggest uh, yard pest for most of us here in Georgia are moles and voles, those tunneling critters that go around our yards and make an otherwise beautiful yard just kind of look wonky. Looks like it maybe has a disease because uh, everywhere they're tunneling, they're actually killing the root system. Whether they're eating the root system, which would be something like voles, those are the herbivores, those are, they eat plants, um, or the moles, those are the, you know, insectivores. Either way, what they're doing is they're exposing the roots of the grass or the plants to air, which by the way, is what kills them. They're supposed to be in the dirt where they get soil and nutrients and water. So this is how you fix that. Now, a lot of us have done the, the uh, big box hardware store uh, pest control solutions, whether you're putting out uh, things in your yard designed to kill the, the food source like grubs. Um, by the way, that's, uh, that's doing a lot of other uh, things to your yard that could be damaging it or making it unsafe. If you're a typical man, you buy these because they look like fireworks, and they're, all of us have a kid in heart. Um, however, the problem with these is they're kind of really toxic, and that is a model rocket engine fuse. It will burn you, um, and it's uh, really not good for the environment. But the thing I just found out that worked like a charm, I'm telling you, I had a client share this with me. So we were about to buy some of those solar-powered uh, isotronic uh, spikes that you put in the ground. So basically, the concept of these things is the solar power uh, powers a little device. The device makes this little you know, sound or vibration or whatever, and it drives them away because it's annoying. And then my client shared this with me, and oh my, I looked at him and I said, if this works, like you should get the Nobel Prize. He should get the Nobel Prize. In two weeks, our yard was completely rid of moles, voles, I don't know what they were, but they're gone. There are no, there is no more tunneling in our yard, and you want to know how it happened? These guys, this, these things, this got rid of them. Now, you might have to have a little conversation with your neighbor and just say, "Hey, by the way, uh, we're just doing a little experiment, and um, this is this is our ticket, and just don't don't let him connect the dots <laughs> that if they're going to leave your yard, they might be going into his. Not important." But these things effectively do the same thing that those isotronic devices that will cost you $50, $100, $150 and may or may not work. I got a dozen of these off Amazon for like, I don't know, $12, $15 maybe. But this accomplishes the same thing those isotronic devices do. So the uh, vibration from the wind goes down the straw into the ground and creates just enough of vibration underneath the soil that it annoys the bejesus out of the critters and they leave. So it doesn't kill them, it doesn't put any chemicals in your yard, it just gets annoying as heck for them and they get out of Dodge. I know what you're thinking, it's, it's too simple, it's too simple. I'm telling you, the best things are the simplest things and they're the most genius things. This does work. I promise you. And if you know me or if you know where I'm at here in Georgia, I'll lend you mine for two or three weeks. You go put them in your yard. You don't even have to buy them. I'll loan you mine. So I'm happy to help you out in real estate if I can. By the way, there's all kinds of homes available right now. They're just not all hitting the market. So if you're in the market to move you need to reach out to an agent like me. It's in your area or can find an agent like me in your area because there are plenty of homes that are still selling and a bunch of them are never going to hit Zillow. So if you need help around the house with solutions like this to problems that you really don't want to go spend a ton of money on and you're like, there's got to be a better solution, I may not know it, but I'll find it out for you. And that's my goal, to be the most helpful person uh, in real estate that you've ever met or experienced or worked with. My information is coming up. I would love to help you out if I can. Have a great day and have a flat yard. I am in my garage. Clear, it's obvious. Don't, obvious things don't need to be said. Um, if you need, ugh, that's not even a sentence. 
Uh, men buy these because they look like tiny sticks of dynamite, and we love things that blow up. <coughs> I love spraying. Ah! You ready for it? You're not ready for it. Like, just, I can't even, I can't even prepare you. I cannot prepare you for the simplicity and the monumental life change that is about to happen um, out of your garage. Well, maybe not out of your garage. It's going to happen out of my garage and in, into wherever you're watching this. Gosh, like, I can't get through 30 seconds. Men will also buy things like these and these. Where did I get them? It's not important. A 30 second text to your neighbors. Uh, we may have gotten those from both of our neighbors. That's like, hey, so what are you doing? And that's kind of where we get into Caddyshack mode where people just start shoving anything um, down the tunnels and hoping that whatever is down there is going to be scared or die. A whole bunch of them. Ooh, um, those are pretty spectacular. Don't ask me why I have them. You don't know. My cat is fighting a ghost. Uh, they're, they're after insect. That's not even science words, but I just made it up. Copyright pending. But nonetheless, they're taking you off Christmas vacation, elf, all in one. And, uh, you know, they're, they're kind of catchy. I kind of like them a little bit. You know, when, when the neighbors just kind of drive by slowly, they're like, is this a sign? Is this like, is, is, did they get kidnapped inside? Is this, you know, like the Egyptian, the pyramids? solstice the wind power blows the little thingy science could be this thing pretty much this pretty so i can uh your garage probably looks similar to mine there's some stuff that should have been burned a long time ago uh, and some other stuff that i just i don't even know what to do with it anymore someone someone random is calling me that you need like 16 bags of. Our, our cat just our, our cat just caught one from the neighbor. They're bringing it over from the neighbor's yard. I'm like you idiot, kill it over there and leave it over there. There's our cat parading it around. Hey, hey, hey! Don't 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 put that on the front step. No. Showing you my garage. Um, that is not a that is not a one-liner. 